to run the 300 at the same pace and then run the 200 a little faster. So I was able to run the 200 a little faster, but my 300 time was a little slower, so I ended up being at the same time. But I'm not even mad about it, I guess, because the, the race was like a month ago and I did get sick of a break, so I'm just happy that I'm not behind. I'm still, it's consistent. But I'm just sure right now, I have the 400 coming up. My throat was hurting so bad. Like when I tell y'all, the vibe is the worst freaking race ever. I hope y'all can even hear me. Yeah, I'm just gonna chill out, warm up for this four, and run my butt off because when I tell y'all the four is so much faster than the five it feels so much better like the five is really deadly man I was so anxious before I ran like I literally started crying and that's why y'all ain't see no footage for real before the race because I was really like panicking but um yeah I'm gonna chill out get ready for this four and I'm gonna see y'all in a little bit Okay, um, I'm so 
I just look at the right Hey y'all, it's Tuesday, two days after the meet, and I just wanted to come back here and check in with y'all again. Um, y'all saw the races. I'm not really like I'm not mad about it, but I'm not happy. Like I wanted to PR, but I did end up running pretty much the same time that I ran at the first meet in the 500. So I'm like, at least I'm being consistent because I did get sick over winter break. So let me just backtrack so our first meet was december 9th and then we went on winter break for two weeks and then we came back to school and trained for two weeks and then had the meet so i did get sick over winter break during those two weeks so i was trying to train but i really wasn't doing like what was recommended like i was just trying to keep my body moving when i could so i'm kind of happy that i even was able to go out and run that time again considering winter break didn't go as planned but then at the same time it's like i at least wanted to pr by like a second or something but i'm gonna just be grateful for still being in a good area it could have i could have went downhill could have been worse but yeah so you just gotta take in the small ones i'm just gonna be happy that i'm being consistent even though i didn't go out there and pr but um yeah, I was a little disappointed in myself, but I'm just like, you just got to learn from this and keep it pushing and try to do better at the next week. So, yeah, and today was the first day of school. So I went to my first class that was from 9.30 to like 12. It's a um, ceramics class. Um, and it was pretty chill. I like my classmates. It's a little small, intimate class. It's probably like 10 of us. So she just read the syllabus. We did like some icebreaker activities it was actually kind of cool like what she did because it wasn't like typical icebreakers and then um i'm back in my room now it's like one it's 119 and i have practice at 3 30 so i'm really gonna be chilling i already ate have my food digest and i do have workout today so then i go die but um yeah i just y'all saw how i was how i was feeling how i was looking doing um after my race and bro when i tell y'all i had runner's cough so bad like my throat was on fire i was even scared to cough because it was hurting so bad but i was popping some um cough drops i'm feeling better um but i know at practice today like it really shouldn't mess with my throat i think it's really because inside of that facility is just so cold so that when we be running we be breathing in that cold air and then it be messing me up, it really do. Yeah, so I just wanted to really use this vlog as like 
uh hmm how do i say this like I just wanted to use this vlog to show y'all that not every meat is going to be a good meat. Like, that's what you, I don't know, like, this is what we expect. Like, oh, every meat I'm going to PR. Every meat has to be good. But in reality, that's not how it's going to be. And, like, I was even debating, like, should I even post this vlog? But I'm like, Jilla, just because you didn't do how you wanted to do doesn't, like, you know, like, I can't just post and show y'all the good. Like, this is real life. Like, not every meat is going to be a good meat. Not every meat is there's going to be a PR. So, yeah, instead of showing you just the good, I'm going to try to show y'all everything. So, I'm going to go ahead and post this. Obviously, I posted it because you're watching it right now. But, um, yeah, thank y'all for tuning into this video. I hope y'all enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if y'all want to see any more chat vlogs um, in the future. I also want to post, like, practice like you know days of my life but i don't know it'd be real chaotic going from class to practice to class to practice and all the other stuff and i don't know practice just be flying and then like setting up the camera and all the other stuff like uh i don't know i'm a, i could try i could try to um vlog like a week in my life or something like that but um i really want to I actually really want to, but it's like, if I record a week of my life, I want to show y'all me going to practice. So, I don't know, maybe I'll have somebody come in and record some footage for me while I'm at practice. But, yeah, um, thank y'all for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm going to see y'all in the next video.